grocery shopping with Jermaine. Now today's gonna be a different vlog. I'm not working today. Today my girlfriend and I are going out in Santa Cruz for some sort of adventure. But right now I just left Starbucks. Stopped in Safeway to grab some pita bread. Then I have to go vacuum the car out because the car looks a mess on the inside. Since I haven't been picking up Uber passengers, why should I keep the inside of the car spotless? Especially when I'm doing like random delivery jobs. Grab some quick food here, then I'll rush off to the car wash, vacuum the inside of the car out, then meet Vanessa back at the house. But for now, I'm so hungry. I think I'm gonna get some oats too because we are out of oats at the house. And this is what I look like when I walk out of the grocery store without a bag. Random stuff in my hands. Here, I'm gonna show you guys something that I do every now and then. It's really good to do. It's an awesome stretch for your legs. It's called legs up the wall. And I'll even show you how to get in the position. You wanna get close to a wall like this here. Just sit down like like so, like near the wall. And then you can sort of like lean back like so. Like lay down. And then you can twist. And then just put your legs straight off the wall. I gotta pull my pants down because my back's on the floor and the floor is really cold. Whew. And if you want, you can take your shoes off. I would recommend you take your shoes off because Actually, I'm gonna have to get up because that floor is really hard. I need to put a jacket down or something. If you have a yoga mat, that would work out perfect. I'm gonna get back in this position really fast. Oh, that floor hurts. Honey, can you close the bathroom door? Oh, yeah. <laughs> My girlfriend's taking a shower, so if you guys hear the, the loud noise, that's what it is. All right, so you want to get you want to get in this position position here, and you want to get your butt all the way up against the wall. I'm sliding back because of this jacket. That's why I said a yoga mat would be perfect. And then you just want to try to straighten out your legs up against the wall, and just hold it here. Now, while this is a good position, is when you're in this position, your feet, the blood can sort of circulate down into your body. And you gotta think you walk like all day. I'm not even in the shot, it's weird. But you walk all day. All right, this is really annoying. Time to get up, move the camera. Okay, well, what's wrong with this camera? All right, let me see. Okay, let's sit back down, get back down. Oh, my back, my butt. Oh, ah, oh, ah, oh. It's really good for circulation because when else are your feet above your heart? Most of the time that, that's not the case for a lot of people unless you're sitting in a recliner at home and I don't typically have a recliner to sit in where my feet would be above my heart. So this is a really good stretch and I usually try to stay here. You can stay here for like five minutes or like two minutes if it hurts. Um, I've stayed in this position for like 30 minutes before and it feels really good. It's an awesome stretch and it's good. It's really good for your body. Really good, especially after driving, driving for a long time. And then also try to do like a squat. Oh man, that's really good after driving. Because every now and then when I drive on the weekends, I may drive like, you know, four or five hours in a row where I don't get out of the car. And that's not good on your hips. So it's good to like get a good stretch in. Down in Santa Cruz right now, Vanessa just ran into the store real fast and grabbed something. Meanwhile, she told me to look for a restaurant to go to. So I found this place, Space Burger. I can't wait to go there. Their menu looks really good. They have a lot of vegan options there. So dark. It's not that dark, you're good. You think so? Mm-hmm. All right, finally made it to Santa Cruz. I picked this place. Well, Vanessa told me about this place before we even got here. The name of this place is, what's the name of this place? Saturn. Saturn. Yeah. So we're about to go in now, check out the food. Down at the Santa Cruz Boardwalk right now. 
Vanessa's inside playing games. I had to rush back outside. I remembered I like reached my hand in my pocket, pull out some cash, and it wasn't there. So I rushed back to the car and discovered that I left it on the seat. Really bad idea, but I was able to get it. Now I gotta go back inside and find Vanessa. Let go. Check out this place on my day off. Let's go find Vanessa really fast, wherever she is. Just hanging out with her. 5,000 tickets, I can get a skateboard. Yippee! I don't know, go for something with a big head on it. Look at, look at, look at the size of this game. Check this out. Isn't that massive? <laughs> this is that lucky jackpot one. Hey babe, there goes some tickets. It's just someone left some tickets. You win some babe? What you win? I don't know, some <laughs> Dang, she's a winner! <laughs> Thing. Yeah, there always gotta be a winner. <laughs> the next big prize are those tickets. We need those tickets. Right there. That's what we need. Oh, five that time. 489 tickets. <laughs> a little Golden State Warriors hat. Coffee cup, peace now. Y'all need some peace? Ooh, a boogie board, perfect for the boardwalk. Truck. Get him a little Jeep. I like that one better. You should get him a race car. Oh, you should get them a race car, huh? Do they go back? Yeah, they, they go back. They just have wheels. It's Sage's 3 plus, but he's smart. Let's see. Ooh, a, a piggy bank for a 100 coupons. Yeah, look at these piggy banks. We can afford these ones. It's a San Francisco vacation fund. Now let's think about that. We don't need a San Francisco vacation fund. No. We need like a European vacation fund. A Southeast Asian vacation fund. What do we think? What is this? Why say? do they have Orange County and Catalina Island shit? That's weird. Orange County? Where is Orange County? Oh. Oops. <laughs> Or is like, you want a cold one? We're gonna go play on the beach. Oh, really? A little Santa Cruz football? Yeah. You could do that. I guess we could. I don't mind. <laughs> Let's do it. That, or we could get a shot glass. Santa Cruz Boardwalk shot glass. Football we can play together right now though. I'm with you on the shot glass. What? I thought you'd been with me on the football. Well the shot, shot glass has more uses. Ooh, you need a watch? Ooh, get, ooh a three-year limited warranty. Power bank with a keychain so you can charge. 
Oh yeah, that was a pretty important. Like, <laughs> oh yeah, they get that. <laughs> yeah. When we could just go buy it for ten bucks. Or seven bucks. Damn, these are three hundred. It's the bottle opener. Yes, sir. Where are you going? Prize Center. What kind, of, what kind of prizes can you get? Wow, 10,000 coupons and you get like this little sleep monitor and oh, with some action glasses for 4,000. Oh, you gotta put the tickets in here. God damn it. I got some tickets too. This out. Vanessa is about to get us 2,000 tickets. We're gonna trade. We're gonna trade that game toy in for tickets. How cool is that? Let's go do it right now. Vanessa wants a warrior head, and it's like 2,500 points, and we got like 2,400 points, so we need to win 100 more points so she can get this hat, and then we can take off, and I believe we're getting massages or something like that. There she go, my girl's back at it, she's trying to win that big prize, she's going for that X. She wants that warrior's beanie. So if we win again, we're going to get the second batch of tickets. First prize Vanessa won like a children's game. It was here. But we was able to get the sales associate to switch it for 2,000 tickets. Okay, yes. here we go. We're good now. We got more tickets. Is that the one you want? That's the one I want. Warrior's beanie. Well, should I get the beanie or should I get the hat? Well, get the beanie. If you want the beanie, get the beanie. I mean, this is an official NBA hat. It is. It is? Are you going to wear it? I would wear it. Yeah. We can share it. But would you wear the Golden State Warriors beanie? I would wear this more than the beanie. Okay, so let's get the hat. Really? You want the hat? Yeah, honey. If cool. We can share it. So how much did this cost? Like 50 bucks? <laughs> <laughs> We're at an Uber now on the way to the spa and then we'll return back here. Such a fun day. Right now Jermaine vlogging in the bathroom. This place is pretty dang sweet. Can't wait to show you guys this place. What is this again? What is this again? What are we doing? We're getting a massage together. Oh, really? That sounds so sweet. <laughs> yeah, how sweet is this? Little double massages? Oh, how so sweet, babe. Wow, what a massage. We have been hanging out here for the past hour. Check it out. Our own private hot tub. Let's go back to the boy walk.
Back on the boardwalk now, looking for um, a snack for this one. Look at her, taking photos with her iPad. Can you believe that? <laughs> That's my girlfriend, taking photos with her iPad. Need a slushy? Take your pit. Just in case one hot dog wasn't enough, how about six hot dogs for $22? Oh, what about one of these Texas style donuts? Gigantic. I really want to get on those. They look like a lot of fun. Vanessa here wants to get on this thing over there. You see that in the background? Yeah, a time, probably. <laughs> and I'm looking at her like, no way, I'm not getting on that thing. Why would I get on that? If I got on that, I would probably throw up the food that I ate like two days ago. You know, come on. Our little photo booth action. <laughs> Here's our ride here, the hang glider. And it's gonna take us on the other side. Okay. Uh, this definitely has to be the highlight vlog right now. I mean, we are having a blast. I love this whole this thing that we're riding on. What is this called, Vanessa? Why are you coughing so much? What is this thing called? This is called the Sky Ride. Yeah, the Sky Ride. Look at, check out this view. <laughs> Oh, uh, look at that guy. <laughs>